What's up guys, my name is Bruno, it's just, you know, so welcome to Blue Week Chatter Channel, I'm here to do another Blue Week DVD update, this is season, season 2 and episode 4, but there's a lot of good stuff to talk about, um, especially one big one in here for this month, I hope you have a, a wonderful month of buying Blu-rays, and let's get right into it. The first one is the big one, I want to get this out of the way first, um, is of, of course, Star Wars The Force Awakens. You can check out my down below for my blue blue review on this blue way. Um fantastic movie. Um, I love this movie so much and I'm very happy to own this on my on Blue for for my collection. And I just, I decided to to buy the regular edition because it comes with this artwork and the black cage and the different artwork. I kinda of prefer this one more than the still book and the Target exclusive. I was supposed to be getting the Target exclusive but the packaging the packaging like that it sucks. That's so why I decided to get this edition. Come in two blueish, one DVD and digital copy and it's a great all around great release um by Disney. <coughs> Check out the Blu-ray review if you want to. It's down below um the full detail about the picture features, the, the picture quality and the other quality. I mean it starts the world it starts the Force Awakens. I have to talk about this Blu-ray. Uh, yeah, I'm happy I own this on Blu-ray and by Star Wars: The Force Awakens. Next one is I have to get this for my DC animated movie universe. Um, we have Justice League vs. Teen Titans with this very reflective Chinese subcover, very all embossed. Um, check it out. Um. I have a lot of fun. It's it's a good fun movie and it's better than Batman Bad Blood, in my opinion. Um, you know, it's a ton of fun. I mean, I mean, the next DC animated movie is The Killing Joke. Super stoked for that, and the trailer looks amazing. I mean, it is. It will be the first R-rated animated movie for DC animated movies. Um, universe. Um, it's a fun movie. It's a good watch. Um, highly recommend it for younger viewers and. Adults, I mean, it is a fun time. I enjoyed this movie, and um, I'm happy to join this on my DC animated movie collection. That's just a thing for Teen Titans on um, Blu-ray, coming Blu-ray DVD to HD. The next one, um, I got it for um, seven dollars, seven AA, seven nine nine, whatever on Walmart. Um, couldn't resist this. Coming to Blu-ray, it's still sealed. Um, that is. Robert De, Robert De Niro, directed by Sergio Leone, that is Once Upon a Time in America, on um, Blu-ray. So I have nothing to say. Um, I heard it's amazing. I heard it's amazing. It's in a standard a director cut. It's almost four hours long. It's four hours long. So I'm gonna find time watching this movie. Com comment below what you think of this movie. I really want to know what your thoughts on this. All I heard is amazing. It's great. It's classic. That is Once Upon a Time in America. Next one, um, I decided to get this because there's a new King Kong movie coming out next year called Kong Skull Island. I have the original digi the original movie on Digibook. It's right there. Now I have the Peter Jackson version of King Kong. The this is the comic book still book. I, I found it for ten dollars on Target for this the still book. Pretty cool still with this a punch, spine, back, and there you go. Nothing too special. I find it upgraded on DVD. I had the DVD in there. Um, I, I kept that. Um, I'm, I'm, I'm not seen this movie for a long time. I, all I know is that I, I fell asleep on movie theaters. Remember that because it's really damn long. It's three hours and eight minutes. And this, this the aesthetic cut in this film is 3 hours and 20 minutes. That's even more um, longer. Um, so I'm going to find time watching this movie. I want to watch this movie before I see Kong Skull Island. So that's King Kong on still book. The last two, um, one of them is an Academy Award winner for Best Actor, Best Director, and Best Cinematography. It is the end of the category of Tom Hardy and I'm so stoked to own this on Blu-ray that is The Revenant. Um, of course, I have to get this movie because it is The Revenant and I'm finally going to say to the other that he is an Academy Award winner. 
and he highly deserved this movie. I kept that sticker, by the way, the Academy Award thing. Um, look at this super cover. Just like Birdman. Amazing. I love they keep doing that. Pretty cool. Um, this movie, I've not watched this movie. It's still sealed. Um, didn't have time to watch this movie. We watched this movie. Um, I saw this movie on my birthday. Really a special day for me. Um, yeah, that's The Revenant on Blu-ray. Pretty stoked. Last but not least, it's nothing big. I really do want to get this on Blu-ray, but I'm going to keep it sealed until, until December. So I can rewatch this film. That is Krampus. Um, it's such a fun movie. Um, I really enjoy this movie. I saw the movie back in, in December with my brother on uh, December, and it's a fun movie. There's this is this decent amount of extras in here. I can see there's this cover, there's the back cover. If you like scary movie, you'll enjoy this movie. It's a horror slash comedy movie. Really fun time, and it's a fun twist for a Christmas movie. And I consider this a Christmas movie, in my opinion, because it's set place in Christmas. And Krampus, I'm not opening yet. I'm hopefully going to wait until December. I'm not sure. But that's Krampus on Blu-ray. That is everything I got for the month of April. Um, come below. What do you think of the title that I talk about? Only six titles. Um, that's decent. The big one I want to get is Star Wars, and that's it. And then I forgot about the revenue that's coming out this year, this month, and I'm like, okay, I have to pick that up. And then the Krampus, there's just Leaf of the Titans. So that's all the movies that I picked up for the month of April. Um, yeah, I mean, subscribe and um, comment below. I mean, follow me on Twitter. That that be, and you can check out my blue review for Star Wars: Force Awakens if you want to see that. I mean. Let me know I can continue doing Blu-ray reviews. This is my very first Blu-ray review or video. Please let me know I can continue making more. Because obviously I'm going to make every Star Wars Blu-ray release on Blu-ray review, special video, whatever. And I'll see you guys next month.